So I'm gonna be playing the most underrated Roblox games ever. Now I'm gonna find these games because in my comments, people have been telling me, play this game, it's so underrated. Play this Roblox game, it's so underrated. So I'm gonna look through my comments, any comment that says some game is underrated, I'm gonna play it in this video. Now they might have been trolling. These games might be bad. Some of these games might be good. We might find some of the most underrated games and I can't wait to play them. As always, if you wanna be featured in my next videos, leave a comment, tell me what game I should play, what I should do, and I always show your comments in the video. So, the first comment that I've ever received talking about a game that was underrated was five months ago. This guy called Phoenix Goku said, most games are really underrated. My favorite Roblox game is Digimon Origins. It usually has about two to six players. So only like two people play this game, but apparently it's underrated. As we play each of these games, once I get done, I'm gonna rate it from one to 100 on how good it is. By the end of the video, we'll know which games were actually underrated and which games were crap. I have a message? Why do I have a message? Hi DJ, you're my favorite YouTuber in history. I have autism and you helped me cope with it. I think you're one of the best person I ever met. I'm wondering if you could friend me, but of course I'm not gonna beg. I thought it would be really awesome. You know what, bro? That was a really nice message. I will accept your friend request. Dude, that dude was right. There's only two people playing this game. Look, I feel like this is gonna be underrated. Let's try this out. So I, I am pretty sure this is like a fighting game or something where you have to like level up and those games are pretty much always fun. Okay, so we're in the game. Digimon Origins. Is this like Pokemon? It's got the Emon. Pokemon. Digimon. Maybe I'm just being stupid. This one's badass. I'm clicking that one. Alright, so I'm a candle. Okay, can I kill this guy? Bam! All right, no, we can't. Okay, so here's an Agumon. Can I like catch this dude or whatever? Hello, traveler, would you like to hear the news? No. When you're level 200, please head towards the paths of the forest. A friend wants to see you. Level 200? Bro, I'm level one. What, what are you talking about level 200, buddy? I don't think I'm ever gonna get there. We found another one of these guys that we can talk to. Hopefully he doesn't tell me the same thing. Hello there, fellow Digimon. Goodbye. Why don't you just say hi and then goodbye? All right, what is this portal? That portal right there takes you to an underground fortress. No one knows what's in it other than some goblin. I feel like this game is underrated, right? But the thing is, there is nobody playing this. How am I supposed to play it? I have to fight people to level up, right? I have to shoot these fireballs at them, these boom, but nobody's in this game. So I'm gonna have to give it a, a zero out of a hundred. I couldn't even play it. This comment says, you should play Roblox most underrated masterpiece, a fine work of art known as how I pooped my pants, true story among us. Even saying that magnificent name is enough to make a grown man cry. This game is clearly a work of art, only describable by playing it. How I Poop My Pants, True Story Among Us? What the f what type of name is that? Okay, so this is actually a real game. What the f P? The description says P. This game is gonna be the first game that we actually give a negative rating. This screenshot says, didn't you steal the chipmunks? He looks like the dude from uh, Alvin and the Chipmunks who stole the chipmunks. Why is there a McDonald's? What? I could, uh, they even have the, what the? F There's just emojis on the wall. Steve from Minecraft? What the? What is going on down here, bro? If you want me to make a full video on this game, exploring the weirdest Roblox game ever, let me know right now. I'm gonna explore this whole world because look, there's just so much to explore down here. This mu- there's so much stuff to explore. So, if you want to make a full video where I explore this whole thing, let me know right now. Comment. I think I'm actually gonna give that game like a- a one out of 100. I have nothing to say about it. The next one was five months ago too. It says, can you play hours? It's an underrated Roblox single player fighting game that only has 400 people playing most of the time. The game is gonna be confusing at first. So it has 294 players. So five months ago, there was 400 players, but this game's going down. Oh, okay, this is me, that's me. Oh, that's badass. Do that again, do the spinner, do the spinner. Oh, okay. So this has a bunch of different things. Let's do this. I mean, this game is cool. Yeah, I, I agree, it's cool. Cool, but I whenever I get to the menu, I am so confused. What is this? All right, that one might have been good if I wasn't stupid. I'm gonna give that a, a five, you know, because at least it was playable. This guy says that Decaying Winter is a underrated game. Hopefully this one is actually underrated because the other two just weren't that good. And oh my gosh, there is zero people playing and this says this game is canceled. I do not have motivation to work on this project anymore. What the f why do I look like this? Maybe there's like a gun in this locker. What the heck is this? A yellow stem? There's a dummy right here. We can punch the dummy. Four, four, four. 
if I charge up a punch, it gets 12. Does this dummy die or does he just re regenerate his health? Because his health is going down. Let's see if this game has realistic physics. If I beat the living heck out of this dummy, is he going to die? One more hit. Uh, all right, man three games in a row all been trashed that one gets gets a five as well So five out of a hundred for that one So this guy says mm2 jailbreak and outlaster are underrated But adopt me royale high and brookhaven and meep city are overrated. I agree. I've played mm2 I've played jailbreak, but I haven't played outlaster this game has 50 1500 players in this server so we're starting in 30 seconds i literally have no idea what i'm going to find here the game seems pretty good first competition where the two teams will face off the winners will be safe from elimination where somebody will be voted out so if you lose you you can get voted out okay it's time to decide the teams all right hopefully i get some good people on my team the game will start with three teams members will be chosen in three two one boom we have our teams this is my team these two she's on my team we lost i'm i'm about to quit i mean we lost this person on my team isn't even moving ah she just delivered a box i got the box let's go let's go let's go i'm doing it i'm doing it i'm doing it come on teammate do something you bum okay i scored a point red team has no points oh fudge this person on my team isn't helping we have one point red has two and Purple has three. Do something, you bum! No, Purple's about to take in two packages and we're losing. She said, hurry, come on. What do you mean, hurry, come on? This, this person didn't even, we lost. Your team has to vote out, vote alien. How, how do we vote her off? So apparently alien just came back. She said, I promise I don't suck at this. So who are we gonna eliminate? She says she's back. Izzy said, I don't know who to vote then. You know who to vote. We're voting for alien. First vote. DJ Alien. Alien. Two votes for Alien. The person voted out is... Yes! That game was cool. It was super, like, suspenseful. My team just sucked. Uh, I guess I'll give it a 30 out of 100. It was pretty, it was pretty okay, I guess. I mean, I wouldn't play it again, but this person said, if you want to know what the best shooter game is, try Bad Business. I feel like I've played this before, but I'm not sure. Let's see. Am I, like, level 2 or 3 or something? Because that'll tell me if I've played this before. I'm level 3. Yeah, okay, let's deploy. Oh my gosh, he's got to be weak. All right, maybe I need to change the gun. Okay, so I got an assist. Get behind the wall. Oh my gosh, he was so weak. Oh, okay, so he just killed me with a machine pistol. I don't think my aim is the best, I'll be honest. Okay, this guy is just murdering me. He's prestige three, level 52. Okay, he killed me again. That's the third time in a row. Got a kill. Got another kill. Got three kills. Got four kills. Got five kills. What the fuck is going on? What is going on? What the hell did I just do? I have seven kills. I just got seven kills right there. What the? Okay, let's put an instant replay on the screen right now. I, I think I must have got like a double kill with that grenade or something. These grenades are good. I'm tossing grenades. I'm not even shooting. I'm tossing grenades. I don't care. Got him. Okay, so this game is kind of fun, bro. Once you... Once you start getting a bunch of kills oh my gosh how am i leading my team all right i'm not gonna lie i'm having a ton of fun with this game where did he just go why the okay i'm having a ton of fun with this game um i feel like i might want to play this for a video you know just trying to level up stuff like that can i get one more kill yes i can let's go boy but i might want to play this game for a video because it's so fun i'm having fun so I feel like this game is definitely underrated, like that guy said. So I feel like that game was like a 80 out of 100. It was pretty fun. It had a ton of stuff to do. That was the best rated game so far. Somebody said, I've been playing an underrated shooter on Roblox, and I can tell you it's probably worth checking out. It's called Deadline. It's most realistic, and it's got amazing customization. So let's see Deadline. You can change a bunch of this stuff. All right, this is the um, weapon I decided on. It looks freaking weird but let's deploy what is going on this is so dark and look when i aim the gun shoots straight up this thing is realistic i see a teammate right here he just died a teammate just died there's another teammate here ah who oh, the damn horror game 
Oh, man, that game was too freaking realistic, dude. If the map was a bit brighter, I think that would have been like a 60 out of 100. Like, that was pretty solid. I liked how you could customize your gun and take the attachments off and stuff. That was good. If you want to watch more videos like this one where I just explore around Roblox, click right here. That'll take you to the Exploring Roblox playlist or you can watch all these awesome videos where I just play stupid Roblox games. Or you can click right here to subscribe to my stupid channel.